Hello and welcome back to Skyrim. Here we are, right outside Pavo's house. Now I'm not really sure who Pavo is, but his house is locked so I should probably not go in there. I mean, it's pretty normal for a house to be locked at, what time is it? 4am in the morning. So maybe I should just let the guy snooze. And, while he's snoozing, I'll check the mine out up above his house. But you know, I feel as if I should check inside to make sure he's okay. Those Forsworn are all over the place. I killed two of them right here. There they are. There's one and there's one. Looters, nonetheless. They could have been looting his house. Oh, 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 but when we last left off, we had just found the Lover's Stone as well. It was glorious. <laughs> and apparently I could have actually figured out where it was a lot easier by just using the compass. But I'm silly like that. I prefer using my gut to find things. <laughs> it may take a bit longer. But it's much more exciting. Force one, what saith you? Give me that. So I think there's a mine up here, right? These mines actually always have so many mineral deposits. So what I'm going to do is, do I actually have my, my pickaxe here? Where is it? What do I have on three right now? What's three? Nothing. Okay. I'm going to put my pickaxe on three. And if there's a lot of stuff in there, then I'll just use the the ghetto method of doing it. I'm not going to eat it. I'm going to smack it with that pickaxe. I'll smack it. Oh, while the moons are out, it burns the target for 10 points. Wow, that's that's perfect. It's exactly what I wanted in my pickaxe. Okay. Where be it, you? There you go. Three. It's just what I wanted. Okay. So I should probably not be using Dragon Bane against non-dragons. And I should probably not use it till I upgrade it, so... Dragon Bane can just chill for now. Kolskr Mine. <laughs> what an amazing name. Kolskr. I know it's probably not even said like that, but I like saying it like that. So I'll say it like that. All the time. Over and over again. I want to just check the spell in to make sure I've got it right. What's it called? Let's see. Kolskegr. <laughs> it's amazing. Amazing. You can say it any way you want, and it will sound cool. It really will. Whoever thought these names up was a genius. Oh, oh. I see you over there. Is this already a, a vein? No, no. No, this is just some rock. <laughs> I wonder if I should try and stabby stabby them, or if it's better. Ooh. No, no, no. Okay, the jig is up. No, this is not gonna work. This is not cool. I should get my bow out now. Okay, power attack time. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, this is not good. This is not good. Get the bow out. My, my one-handed skill is not high enough. No, wow! What a charge! Well done, lady! And, did I just shoot the arrow in the back of her head? <laughs> no, 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 it's in her collarbone. Not quite the same. That's strange. That's a strange angle to hit someone at. Okay, so that, I kind of- Oh, here they come. I kind of messed that one up. Okay, not gonna sugarcoat it. That was bad. What, what the heck? Force one briar heart? Where are all these guys even coming from? Another one? Okay. What? Now there's another one on the right hand side. You've got to be kidding me. Did I just pull the entire mine here? Well, that- gonna make it easier exploring the rest of the mine, isn't it? Because <laughs> I just wiped the entire Forsworn population of this area out. It's okay with me. Okay, so these Forsworn weapons and armor and everything, it's just okay. It's not amazingly good. It's okay. I'm not gonna take it for myself. I wouldn't actually mind... And I'm just spitballing here. What if I get Mule the Lioness and I make her wear the Forsworn armor? <laughs> She seems like the kind of person who would be totally embarrassed by that. Totally. And she'd look super handsome in it. So maybe I'll do that. Maybe. I don't have enough weight. What? Really? What am I carrying that that's, that's that heavy? What? I want to try the Eye of Malka out. I really do. I really, really do. 
What do I have that's this heavy? Nothing. Did I pick something up by accident somewhere? That's just like super, super heavy. No, I didn't. You know, it's just my silly alchemy habits catching up to me. I need, really, really need to get rid of all these ingredients and all these potions. I'll keep the healing potions, I'll keep the useful potions, but all the ingredients, I'm going to chuck them. I don't need them. How much gold do I have? Okay. Fine. Okay, so the whole mule, the lioness plan, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. I will introduce her to the blades, and then she can use that armor. Oh, oh, press three. Let's try this. Some ghetto mining. <laughs> gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> I wonder if this levels my one-handed skill. Defeated. That was so quick. Is this one? Oh, 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 oh. Chill. Chill, Lumen. <laughs> There's no longer any gold in there. Man. I'm some sort of savage. Let's check it out. <laughs> that is the most violent mining I have ever seen. Okay. Something tells me I'm not making it out of here. Oh, this is already depleted. I'm not going to make it out of here with all this ore. It's just not going to happen. Oh, what the heck? Wine? Creme to hawker meat? No. I'll eat that. Rabbit leg? I don't want to eat that. You can get out of here. Oh, sweet rolls. Yummy. Okay. There we go. Much better. For now, at least. <laughs> Till I violently assault another mine. Then it won't be fine. <gasps> Fear poison recipe. What? Okay. <gasps> Briar heart. Ooh. Glass dagger. Is that better than the elven dagger? I don't think so. Huh. It doesn't matter. What is that sound? What? What's that sound? Get out of here! Was it... What is that sound? I just... Is it you? Pheasant? Are you not completely dead? What's going on here? This is maddening. This is actually maddening. Oh, oh. What's in the knapsack? Ooh. A dance with fire. Volume 4. Oh, oh, wow. That is some good value to weight ratio right there. What is that sound? I just... I can't take it. Oh. Shh, shh, shh. Who's to say I killed them all? Who's to say? You know, I'm probably missing a bunch of ore veins, but it's not a big deal. It's no biggie. I mean, my smithing is maxed. What am I even taking... What am I even taking this stuff for? Huh? Oh, goodness. Now I realize. I should actually rather just keep the potions and get rid of the ore. Because why? Why would I want the ore? I don't even know. I don't even know. Okay, ore. You're getting out of here. You guys are probably going to tell me all the cool things I can make with ore, but... I don't care. <laughs> just, it weighs too much. It actually weighs too much to make sense. And this Debella stat... What, what am I going to do with the Debella statue? Iron ore? No. Get out of here. <laughs> Pelagius' hip bone? Okay. That's fine. Quicksilver ore? Nah. No, you know, Quicksilver is actually a little bit... Oh, look at that. Wow. That kind of makes me feel bad for dropping it. Quicksilver might be worth keeping. I'm not sure it will be, but it might be. What the heck? Pala Volume 1. <gasps> look at this little fur tracker wagon. That's cute. <laughs> Oh, oh, wow, okay. You see, if you actually really... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I just pick that up? If you actually really pay attention, then... Get out of here. Then you can get... There are some gold bars in there. <laughs> that's, so, that's so sneaky of them, hiding it in there. Whoa. Okay. Okay, so if I ever want some ore, I can come back here. There's tons of it here. I don't want ore right now, though. I really don't. Okay, even more. This is crazy. I shouldn't even go into mines anymore. I literally killed every single one of them right there at the entrance. That 
that's that's terrible. I mean, I thought it would make it much easier exploring here, but it actually makes it a little bit boring. Oh, okay, this would have been the mother load if I was looking for gold ore. But considering I'm not, it really isn't. Some more. What the heck? And this? Well, I suppose it's time to go down here. <laughs> Where's this taking me? Oh. Oh, I see where it's taken me. Back to the start. Oh, what a boring mine. Well, I suppose it's exactly what I should have expected from a mine. Filled with gold. Goodness. Okay, okay, okay. So, now, after we've explored that... Wow, look at those loading times. Something's good. Something's working. <laughs> uh, now, what I was going to say was our plan is... Get out of here, local man. We're going to head towards Markoth and... I know it actually pains me to say this, but we're not going to go in to Markoth. We're not going to do it. We're going to take the cart immediately because I've been told that the Thieves Guild questline will send me to Markoth. And who knows, maybe the main questline will also send me there. So, we're going to do some structured adventuring. You know? I know it sounds bad. It actually sounds a little bit bad. Not going into Markoth, but still, it kind of makes sense. It makes sense not going in there now and rather just saving it and all the quests in it, in the town, in the city. I don't know if it's a town or a city, because I've never been there. But it makes more sense saving them for when I actually need to go there. Also, I'm going to be running around so much, and because I don't really quick travel, it kind of makes it difficult to do that. I might actually quick travel soon, um, after I've taken the cart. I might just quick travel up the 7,000 steps, because I don't need to walk those 7,000 steps again. I know it's meant to be an experience and all that, but I've experienced it like three times. No need to do it again. So, so where is Markoth? I mean, I'm supposed to have seen it by now. Isn't it a city? It's supposed to be pretty big. Where are they hiding it? <laughs> it's so weird. Okay. Maybe it's a cave town. Who knows? Who even knows? Well, a lot of you probably know because you've probably been there already. But I don't know. Oh, oh! What the heck? What is this? What is this architecture? It looks amazing! Is this just someone's house? Wow. That's very ornate. My goodness. Chicken, what do you make of this? How does it feel living on a farmstead that's this glorious? I gotta go in here. Salvius. Now that's the name I'll remember. At least till I leave the farm. Wow. Okay. What is this? Vigdus Salvius. Oh, and Rogatus Salvius. What? That's impressive, oh, dude. that frown off your face, Rogatus. You've been wearing that frown for over 50 years now. Really? You want me to smile? What's there to smile about? These two. Soldiers and wow. dragons are going what to be characters? traveling all over the crops this year. I just know it. Oh, stop being such a grouch. Not every visitor to the farm wants to burn it down. Maybe Are you guys busy telling me this? Nice supper with us, hmm? You don't invite monsters into your home to have <laughs> supper. I won't have them here, and I'm certainly not smiling for them. Well, I kind of... I, I appreciate that, dude. Oh, oh whoa, 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 whoa! What's this? A visitor to our farm. Oh, do stay for a while, dear. Uh, okay. Okay. You need to leave. What? What? You just Not invited me to stay for a while. Oh, Vigdus. Vigdus, Vigdus, Vigdus. I think living out here all this time has made you kind of cray cray. What the heck? Time for you to get going. Okay, jeez Louise. You just invited me in there. No, you know what? I want to talk to you. Are you going to follow me out? Please just follow me out so I can talk to you. Let's do it out here. Come, come on. Okay, I'm going back in there. No, oh, it's locked now. They kicked me out and they locked the door. Wow. How rude. How rude. That's so bad. Okay, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Those two. So rude. I don't whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on? What is it? What is it? Dragons? <laughs> no. No. Just some really rude farmers. Wow, these little settlements look so nice. Love. What happened to you, Pavo? Pavo! The Forsworn have taken Kolskager mine. We're the only ones left. Oh! oh God. It's Pavo. 
You two head inside and get some rest. Pavo, it's okay. Word to the Jarl. I've cleared the mine. Don't go to Kolskager. It's not safe. Kolskager. You're not saying it right, dude. It's Kolskager. We survived that. What next? Did you hear that? Pavo and Gabo is not a good one. Kolskager mine is lost, friend. You're from Kolskager? Was. Forsworn came in the night, killed everyone. Gat and I are the only ones who escaped. I didn't see any dead bodies. Skaggy will send word to the Jarl, and something will be done. Dude, I've done it. What if I took care of the Forsworn? I'd be grateful. Kolskager is my home. But I wouldn't go there if I were you. There's a whole group of them with axes and magic on their side. Look at the cute puppy. Never stand He's barking at her. Wow. Oh, you never stand a chance, dude. Dude. I'm the Dragonborn. I mean, come on. How many times do I have to tell these people that? It's, oh, look at this. He just told me I never stand a chance. Now look at this. You drove them off? By yourself? Uh, yes. Thank I you. just told you I'm the Dragonborn. Right away. Take this. It's the least I can do. Please don't give me gold. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, that's a lot of gold coins. All right, then. No problem. Hey, girl. What's happening? That's a cute puppy. Oh, it's a cute goat as well. <laughs> Very nice. Hey, hey, hey. What's this? Torum. It's almost like Torum. Dude, why do they call it left hand mine? Can the miners use their right hands too? They probably can, girl. Skaggy. Don't have much to say. Do you own this mine? That I do. If you want to grab a pickaxe and dig up some iron, feel no. free. No. I'll pay no. for anything have you, you bring. Have you met Torum? He's the best dog in the room. He does look very nice. He does look like the best dog, girl. He does. Oh, you're very cute. He's very handsome. You're not a Nero puppy, but close enough. Close enough. Skaggy's house. You know, I don't want to check these houses. Unless one of them's, like, really big in to be adventured in or explore miners' barracks. We can look in here. These places look so nice. I do like it. Oh. You have got to be kidding me. What kind of barracks is this? They'll fit, like, two miners in here. Or one miner in here. What the heck? Take the gold. Thank you. Let's get out of here. Okay. I'm the hardest worker in left hand. Better than any man. Oh. Uh, if you say so. That's okay. Good, good. Now. Where is Mark? Oh, oh, I see. I see. That's nice. I feel like I'm in Lord of the Rings. Looks like I'm heading towards Helm's Deep. <laughs> really, it does. Doesn't it? It, it sort of... Looks a little bit like it could have been Helm's Deep. I don't know. I don't know. It's been a while since I've watched Lord of the Rings. Oh, Juniper. I'll take it. What's with all the dogs? How are the new breeds getting along with my dogs? Haven't attacked each other yet. Good a sign as any. Do you have whiskers, man? Are those whiskers you painted on? Need a trained war dog? Fiercest companion money can buy. You know, I'd really not mind getting a trained war dog. Wow, nice armor horse. I wouldn't mind, but... Oh, Vigilance. Wow. Yeah, you see, I would actually get one, but I'd feel way too bad if they died. I can't do that. Like, I can't do that. Same reason I don't really take Frost on adventures with me is... is because... You know, I'd feel bad. This is Markarth, Traveler. Safest city in the Reach. Really? Break the law in Markarth, and it's off to Sydney Mine with you. Okay. What have you guys say? I really want to go in here. I want to just have a look. Maybe we should just go in and have a peek. Okay? A little peek. What is this? No, no, we'll go up there. I'm going to go into Markarth and just have a look. I mean, I know I said I'm not going to explore in here or do any quests or anything, but I want to see how it looks. I want to see what all the fuss is about. Is there fuss? There should be. I mean, from the outside, it looks quite nice. Goodness. This is the one that they always give you. This doodad. You always get it when you enter in a big city. I got the same one going into solitude. I remember. I remember it like it was yesterday. But the second we done having a peek, we leaving. We're taking the carriage to White Run, and then from White Run we're going up the seven thousand steps to speak to the Greybeards. Gotta find out about that shout. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be really, really good. Swords swing faster than axes. And axes swing faster than maces. I'm assuming maces do more damage than axes. And axes do more damage than swords. I figured it all out. One of the many mysteries of Skyrim. Done. 
Wow. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. What the heck? Hey, dude! What? what? Hey, hey, hey. What was that? Forsworn. Oh, I see. Dude, you kind of deserve that. That was a douchey move. You just killed this lady. Margaret. Everyone stay back. I took a key. The Marcos city guard have this all under control. What's going on, man? We'll handle things from here. Move along. That man shouted something about the Forsworn. I said move along. The Forsworn are just a bunch of madmen. Okay. We have everything under control. None of my business anyway. That's right. It isn't. Jeez Louise, right these guards are really mean. Margaret, he... he killed her. Right in front of me. I... I was Did right here. Did you see here. that madman? A Forsworn agent. Did you know? Who was she? She's a traveler from the Imperial City. Came by every day looking for jewelry okay. for her relatives back home. A oh, shame. Why would anyone want to kill her? Doesn't make any sense. It doesn't. I think he was just killing someone randomly. What's happening to this and city? You? Did you see that, Madman? A forsworn agent. Here in the city. I... I see he is. Think he worked down at the smelter. A lot of laborers there are sympathetic to the Forsworn. Oh, they okay. They promise people they'll kill off all the Nords that rule over the Reach. Nothing but murderers and saboteurs. You've got a funny face, man. This has ruined <laughs> my entire day. <laughs> you kind of ruined the lineup here, man. I'm not going to talk to you. Move along. Okay. So, this place looks absolutely amazing. God. What? A woman attacked right on the streets. Dude, I was just talking You're about right? that. Did you see what happened? I saw it all. He almost killed me. No, he didn't even touch me. Okay, I'll just say that anyway. I'll just, I'll just say. I'm that. so sorry. I hope the aid give you more peace in the future. I'm okay, man. Oh, Don't worry about you it. Drop this. Some kind of note. Looks important. What? What? Do you know anything about the attack? No. What? What kind of note is this anyway? What is this? Your note? What does it mean? My note. No, that's yours. Must have fallen out of your pocket. It's probably something really shifty. Hmm? No. I was just getting some fresh air. Had one too many he was just to talking about the attack. These people in this place All right, then. are crazy. Okay, what's this note that he gave me? What the heck? Can't I organize it by date received? Oh, this is it. Meet me. Please move that text. At the Shrine of Talos. Okay. The Force One Conspiracy. Wow. Look at this place. Amazing. Oh. <gasps> It's actually pretty big. No way. Okay, okay, okay. Shh, shh, shh. Are there houses up there? No, we're getting out of here. We are getting out of here before it sucks us in. <laughs> because it's going to do that. I mean, I think we all know it's going to do that. So, now we're going to take the wagon. And we're going to head up the 7,000 steps. And that's going to be that. That's going to be the end of it. Well, or the start. <laughs> Depends on what we hear there. It all depends on that. These Markarth people, I don't know if I like them. I really don't. I mean, they are a little bit crazy, aren't they? Aren't they? Those two at the farm, they really didn't want me there. Well, at first they did want me there, but then they didn't. <laughs> and then they kicked me out and locked the door. Crazy. Okay, wagon, it's you and me time. Give me that, Juniper. So, Sandy, that's going to be it for this episode. Check back here soon for more. Hopefully very soon. Most importantly though. Happy having a look at Markoth. And clearing the Forsworn out of that mine. Happy both of those things. <laughs>